I was, uh, for those of you that are not familiar, I was working on uh, boats on the base. Uh -huh. It was a routine call where a fuse was blown in the headquarters building and we were going to refuse the building. Um, as I went to go take my switch stick to pull the fuse out of the carriage up from the pole, instantly I seen this bright light in this arc. Oh, I, dropped my, I dropped my stick and went down to the bottom of the bucket and I just heard this loud explosion and all this buzzing and I seen this huge white light. Hey. And um, mm. Apostle, Apostle told me, he said, I should have been burned. Yeah. I should have had, matter of fact, I should have been blinded because the light yeah. is so yeah. bright. Yeah. Um, but there were some things the Lord also revealed to me. Oh, no. uh, one, we had just started this fast. All right. Two, my wife had prayed for me, and she prayed a distinctive way prior to me leaving work that she had never prayed for me before. Wow. Fasting and prayer. Hello, somebody. These kind, these kind only come out through fasting and prayer. And, 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 and the third thing was the Lord had revealed that that bright light was not, you, you thought you saw the fire, but my angel, I sent, I sent, I protected you. He, he will protect you from dangers seen and unseen. I've never seen the righteous forsaken or his seed begging bread. What was meant to destroy you, God said not so. No weapon formed against you shall be able to prosper. And every tongue that rises against you in judgment, God has given you the power to forgive it. That means you can speak to some folks and you can cancel some things and say, you know what? Because you did what you did to me, everything that you ever touched is now free. Do you know you have the ability and the power for that? Jesus cursed the fig tree. He was showing you a type. Yeah. The, the, the apostles got it so they were ready to call fire down from heaven. And yes, Jesus had to say, don't do it. Don't, don't do it. it. Ah! That's it. That's it, man. That's what's in, that is the greater one that's inside of you. Yeah. Greater is he that is in me yeah. than he that is in the world. Yeah. It's come to a point where we have to really walk this thing. Yeah. We really have to walk this word out and do what the word says. Yeah. Yeah. Man. You you, you, you 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 walk by the mayor's office and says, okay, if there's a homosexual in office, you say, you know what, you won't be on. Either he has to conform and be right, or he has to get out the office. Walk in the authority. Walk in the vocation. Someone might say, well, you know, you didn't get burned because of the, the, the training, and that was a part of it, too. The training was a part of it. This electrical uh, crap. So when, when, the, when, the, when the apostle is, is, is teaching, when the apostle is teaching, not, 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 not Mr. Hughes, not, 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 not the apostle is teaching. Come on, man. Hey, hey. See, apostles became apostles. evangelical people. Yeah. 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 But he calls some to be apostles, some prophets, yeah. some evangelists, yeah. some pastors, yeah. some teachers yeah. for the perfecting of the saints, yeah. for the work of the ministry, for the edifying of the body of Christ. Yeah. Yeah. It's going to take all of us. Yeah. But some of us have been to churches where you're only seeing maybe two out of the three or one of, you know. Yeah. Yeah. I came up where, I came up in a ministry where it was, it was a violation to question the pastor. Ah! How dare you question the man of God? Who are you? Uh, you better? Yes. Right? Well, pastor was something I didn't explain. Some churches, you can't even get to the pastor before there's these five or six security guards. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's not approachable. All right. How did we get here? So, so I, I was in that bucket, and so I, I, I learned some things. I, I, I'm still feeling some pain from that event, yeah. but guess what? That pain reminds me. Woo! I never thought I would say this, but there's some pain that you go through that will remind you of where you came from. <laughs> yeah. Because if you're not reminded of where you came from, you, some of you will just get too high-minded. Yes, sir. Holier than thou. Just because, just because you stand behind here doesn't make you better than anybody else. Who do you think you are? That was for somebody. You can't even say hello to some folk. Because you got a little title, a little, you know. Oh, man. Care about your title? Care about you obey? That's what God 
the same. Obedience. To whom much is given, much is required. Obedience is better than sacrifice. Somebody take this microphone. Amen. Amen.